A SWAT team raided this house in the villages looking for drugs. They came in with the SWAT team fully geared up and with their guns drawn. And New for five, investigators say once they got inside, they found a whole other criminal enterprise. Sumter County deputies say that home was doubling as a chop shop for golf carts, which is the preferred transportation in the villages. Five people under arrest for it tonight. Channel 9's Mert Price spoke with homeowners who were awakened by the raid. And Mert, the neighbors told you they knew something bad was going on at the home, but the chop shop game came as a total surprise. Yeah, neighbors told us they were surprised by it all. They say that they knew something was going on next door, but they didn't know exactly what was happening. And they say many cheered when they saw the SWAT team roll in. Today, deputies showed up here in full force to serve drug warrants at this home in the 1900 block of Antonio Place in the villages. A little over a month ago, some of the neighbors uh, came to us and said and suspected some type of drug activity. Investigators say undercover deputies bought drugs here three separate times. This morning, deputies raided the home and made five arrests. Here's mug shots for four of the suspects. Deputies also seized meth, marijuana, and drug paraphernalia. I'm just a little surprised that this is happening in the villages, but things like this are happening everywhere. While on the scene, investigators made another discovery. We actually found some golf cart parts as well. We have had some uh, golf carts have been stolen in the neighborhood within, within the villages here, and we are trying to tie possibly these parts into some of the stolen vehicles. Deputies say some of the suspects arrested in the raid are also suspected of stealing golf carts. So along with being a drug house, they believe the house was also an illegal golf cart chop shop. Deputies say the elderly homeowner's niece, Kathleen Unrath, was supposed to be looking after him. Instead, they say she was running the illegal businesses behind his back. It is sad that, you know, family would take advantage of the elderly like that. Now, we learned that 21 golf carts were stolen in Sumter County and 22 in Marion County over the past few months. Officials say this case is still under investigation. We're live in the Villages. Mert Price, Channel 9, Eyewitness News.